Hey guys, welcome back for another weekly update video. Had some awesome brand new products arrive this week, including this beautiful V900 from eFlight. Let's get into it and show you what we've got. The V900 is a brand new release from eFlight. This is a super quick pylon racing style aircraft and a really exciting release. Now this aircraft comes in two versions, plug and play, in which you need to add your own receiver, a suitable battery and charger and then Bind and Fly Basic, which comes with a Spectrum AR636 receiver, which will give you AS3X, which is your three-axis gyro, um, as well as Safe Select. So some nice features to be had on the BNF version if you do currently use a Spectrum radio system. Uh, on the battery side of things, this aircraft does have a, a reasonably wide range of battery it can take. We're looking at a 2200 3S, uh, even, and even up to a 2200 4S. Uh, so you do have the two options, 3 and 4S. Uh, 3S, you're gonna get approximately 100 mile an hour, um, and the 4S is gonna be 120 mile an hour plus. So on the 4S, this aircraft's gonna be exceptionally quick. Um, one nice feature in the box is they do include a aluminum spinner to suit the aircraft. Uh, a nice little touch, nice little extra that you do get in the box uh, with this plane. Um, the aircraft does come pretty much fully assembled. Uh, the wing screws on with two bolts, the tail, um, the horizontal stab slides in uh, and screws in with one screw as well. Um, it does have a nice hatch, <clears throat> even though it's a skinny airframe, a nice hatch uh, with enough room to fit your battery in there. And um, some nice extra features for a plane that's gonna perform at these kinds of speeds. Um, the fuselage is reinforced with some carbon fiber rod. There's also a wooden deck in there. So um, it does make it nice and strong, nice and durable. The wings are nice and, uh, nice and durable as well. So it's a fantastic aircraft and sure to be a hell of a lot of fun to fly. The Mini Convergence is a new release from eFly and a scaled down version of a very popular aircraft they had before called the Convergence. Now this is, uh, as the name suggests, much smaller, uh, able to be flown in a lot uh, larger variety of situations. So indoor flight with this is, is gonna be really, really good. So uh, basketball stadiums, uh, large sheds, garages, that's gonna be perfect for this to fly and it can also fly outdoors. Um, it is a VTOL aircraft and it does have transitioning motors on the front. So that's operated by a servo mechanism that transitions the motor from vertical to horizontal. And the aircraft will transition from vertical flight to horizontal flight uh, with just the flip of a switch. So you do have some really good control in not only multi-rotor mode, uh, but the aircraft is quite capable in airplane mode when you're flying forward. So it's quite a high performance aircraft. Now this uh, again comes in two versions, uh, plug and play where you need to add your own receiver and a BNF basic, so it does come with a Spectrum receiver. So if you currently own a Spectrum radio, you'll be able to take this out the box, uh, bind straight up to it and go out and fly with some little bit of programming into your radio, which is covered in the instructions. Uh, regardless of which version you purchase, you will need to buy a battery. Uh, this takes an 800 milliamp 3S LiPo. So you should get quite good fly time out of this. Um, and that's quite a decent sized battery. And then you need a charger to suit that battery. So uh, that choice is up to you. But all in all, a really exciting release. Uh, taking a very popular aircraft, scaling it down, making it able to be flown in uh, more locations. And um, they've also improved the transition between vertical and horizontal flight. So it happens a little bit faster. Um, probably on the, the big convergence, it was never being flown indoors. The transition was uh, reasonably quick, um, but the mini ones made it even faster, uh, which is gonna be perfect for when you're flying in those tight spaces. <laughs> If you own a transmitter, you'll know that traveling around to the flying field or out to the place of flying, uh, it's always important to keep, make sure the transmitter doesn't get damaged in transit. Now, a nice hard case like this is gonna keep your investment uh, in better condition, uh, reduce the risk of damage happening to the sticks or gimbals or dropping the transmitter, and generally just keep it safe. Uh, Spectrum have released a new case for the iX12. This will fit a couple of other radios, but obviously with the iX12 branding on it, probably gonna be more appealing to the people that own iX12s. Um, but if you have one and you're looking for a case that will suit um, your radio as a drop-in fit, cut out foam, there's plenty of space inside to keep uh, spare receivers, switches, batteries, some tools, things like that. Um, this is a really nice option. A nice little lecture that Spectrum have thrown in the box is a screen protector. So if you have an iX12, they've got an alcohol pad in there for you to clean the screen up, get all the fingerprints off and um, put a brand new screen protector on to keep that screen looking and working uh, as good as new. So fantastic option. If you have an iX12, I'd suggest you check this out. We've just had the Torment from ECX arrive back into stock. This does come in two color options, obviously the red and black here, also a green and black version. 
This car is a fantastic option uh, for beginners, uh, for a first time car, for those looking for a present, but maybe for a younger child, um, or even, even, old, even older people, this would be a perfect starting car. Uh, it does come as a complete ready to run, so everything you need to go and drive is included in the box, even down to the AA batteries for your transmitter. So there is a charger that plugs into the wall at home that charges the car's battery. Um, it's fully assembled, so all you need to do when you get it home really is charge the battery, put the double A's in the transmitter, and you can go and have a bit of fun. Uh, this does come with a LiPo battery, so they have upgraded the battery that is included. LiPo gives you a slightly higher voltage, which basically translates into a faster car. So this is a, quite a good speed. Um, speaking of speed, the radio has a nice feature on it. It has a thing called a throttle limiter. Uh, so you have the option of setting it to 50%, 75%, or 100%. Um, and what that does is limits the throttle, uh, the throttle travel. So if you have, uh, say you're buying it for a younger child, say maybe five or six years old, you could limit it to 50%. Uh, the car would be half as fast and it would also last uh, on a battery twice as long. So he's gonna get more play time from one battery um, and also not have a car that's crazy fast that he's you know, gonna, likely gonna break um, when learning how to drive it. So a really nice feature um, with this included transmitter is that you can slow it down. You can give beginners a good chance to have a go and, and, and have, have a learn at the same time without smashing the car. Nice big durable Lexan body. The short course truck style cars are, are generally quite durable. Big bumpers stop you smashing into things, stop the inside of the car getting damaged. Um, another neat feature with the speed controller included with this car, which is a dynamite unit, is that whilst it has a LiPo battery in the car and it is set up for LiPo, it does have a neat little jumper and you can move that jumper across if you do want to run a nickel metal style battery. So if you already have uh, some nickel metal style batteries, they will fit straight into this car. Um, and they will be able to run on this speed control. So you have flexibility with both styles. Um, does come pre-installed with a full spectrum receiver and radio system, um, as well as a nice server here and a dynamite brushed motor and ESC. So really good car for a beginner, uh, really a lot of fun and quite durable. So if you're looking for a present coming into Christmas time, I suggest checking the Torment from ECX out. <laughs> The Piper Cherokee 1.3 meter is a new release from E-Fly. Uh, this aircraft is a beautiful scale rendition of the full-size Cherokee and is marketed towards the uh, intermediate pilot. So if you're transitioning out of a trainer, maybe into your uh, second, probably third aircraft, this would be a fantastic option. So this aircraft does come in two versions, plug and play, bind and fly, uh, bind and fly with receiver. Um, with the receiver and the bind and fly, you will get the AS3X, which is your gyro. Um, and you'll get a safe select, so you'll have safe panic recovery uh, available to you if you have a Spectrum radio system. This aircraft is um, beautifully finished and super scale, so Piper have actually endorsed this, um, and with the features on the aircraft, it presents really well in the air and on the ground. Uh, it does have fully functioning flaps, um, and it is a, a full, full house system in this aircraft. Uh, one of the neat features with the electronic system is that the aircraft is capable of taking a 3S and a 4S. Uh, generally with the aircraft of this size, you see them take a 3S or a 4S, but not um, necessarily set up to perform on both. Um, so this aircraft can take a pretty wide range of battery. We're looking at 2200 all the way up to 3200 milliamps um, in both the 3S or 4S setup. So obviously in the 4S, you're going to have a lot more power. Um, a lot more vertical climbing performance and generally a more lively aircraft. And on the 3S, it's going to be uh, more, more to scale with its flight characteristics. So um, we will be doing a video on this aircraft. So please keep an eye on our YouTube channel, uh, on Facebook, on social media. We'll have a, a flight video on this. We'll put it together and, and put it through its paces. So pretty excited and looking forward to doing that. Thanks for joining us today, guys. Had some really cool product to show you and some brand new product. Uh, that's just recently arrived to us. So super excited about the V900, the Cherokee, Mini Convergence, even the iX12 radio case and the Torment. They're fantastic products and uh, really excited to have these in stock and share them with you today. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention in the video with the Mini Convergence, you would have seen the unit I had was plain white foam. This aircraft does come with uh, multiple trim scheme uh, sticker sets in the box. So you will get the opportunity to sticker that aircraft up to suit your liking um, and you have a variety of sticker schemes to choose from. So, um, and keep an eye out for the video on the Cherokee. We're excited about that and that's going to be going up pretty shortly. So um, keep your eyes peeled for that. But otherwise, um, we'll see you next week, guys. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>